Hello guys, welcome to another video from our channel Soulmate Pharma. So today we'll be looking after various pharmacovigilance job opportunities which are currently available in the market. So let's move on to the first opportunity and just see what is there. So the first job is for clinical pharma clinical pharmacies at Amri Hospital. So this hospital is basically at Kolkata, Mukundupur. The Mukundupur it's at Central Kolkata. So Mukundupur is at South Kolkata basically. So someone if staying in Kolkata, he or she can apply for this job. So. They have an immediate requirement for clinical pharmacists and they are also welcoming freshers and if you are interested then you can drop your CV to this mail ID, Yahoo mail ID and your role should be clinical pharmacist activity and clinical research activities. So. The next opportunity is at Saito Clinic Pharmaceutical Limited. So they are hiring for senior position for narrative writer. And if you have experience in narrative writing, then you can just share your resume to shweta.jaskar at that cytoclinfarm.com. So they haven't mentioned anything elaborately. So basically, if you are in if you know narrative writing, you have written narrative, which we basically do during our ICSR case processing in pharmacovigilance sector. So if you have that sort of experience, then you can just drop your CV or contact the person, Shweta Chaskar, and if you are found to be eligible, then they will contact you. So the next opportunity is for BSc, BPharm, MPharm graduates. That means like all licensed graduates they are considering. So there is an opportunity for back end or back process officer at day shift at IKS Health. So they have provided a brief idea about brief details about their company. So. IKS Health is a leading global healthcare company that provides a suit of, suit of product and service that help US based hospitals, physician groups, and other healthcare providers operate more efficiently and effectively. So, that, what would be the role? The role would be to manage US physicians' document on the electronic platform. Should you sh should electronically receive scan documents from the clinic which needs to be indexed and filed in the electronic health record the abstractor will need to abstract relevant information from these documents in each patient's account the file and abstracted data will be approved rejected by the physician rejected documents needs to be collected by the abstractor and sent for physician's approval so the responsibilities are to understand clinical and non-clinical documents received from the clinic to understand the document type for filing the document, understanding the naming convention for indexing the document, abstract relevant clinical data like impression from diagnostic or lab reports in patient's electronic account. So the eligibility criteria is freshers or science graduates, any science graduates can apply for this job, MPharm, BPharm, BSc, MSc graduates, MSc, these candidates are welcomed. So the shift is day shift, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m., 9 hours duty for 5 days in a week. That means Saturday and Sunday will be holiday. So updated requirements, basic requirements are you need to send updated CV and other card and candidates should be single dose vaccinated at least so they are also taking care of vaccination so if you are vaccinated then they are just seeking or looking for vaccinated candidates so you can send your updated cv and other card to preeti.balmiki at the so 
it's at Mumbai, it's at, sorry, it's at Maharashtra, Paroli, and the contact details have also been provided. You can contact this person, Preeti, at this mobile number also for any sort of further inquiries or further details. So, so the next opportunity is at Eli Lilly. So this is a CRO company, Eli Lilly and company hiring um, associates for their safety operations department. So they are hiring, hiring pharmacovigilance associates basically. The key responsibilities are to provide operational support for following but not limited to pharmacovigilance and observation study related to activities. So basically you need to per perform safety management activities related to investigational products and devices during development phase. That means DSUR development, RMP development, post launch RMP material development, query responses, etc. So you should be able to handle DSUR development safety update, report risk management plan, this short of X experiences they are looking for then safety management activities related to release product and medical devices in post launch phase rmp maintenance safety material development and maintenance safety report development safety central capability activities to support safety support to safety response manager in japan eppp management safety information provisions to customers tpo management etc clinical case management operational support for all the case management activities like case received case processing matrix data handling development and post launch phase evidence creation that means in this you need to they need operational support for pmss and observational studies that is protocol development support and other study document development such as icf training materials study team meeting report gpsp inspection support etc so they are looking for bachelor's degree in pharmacovigilance, life science or any other healthcare professional fields or equivalent experience. You should be profession, you should have proficiency in use of Microsoft applications like Word, Excel, PowerPoint, Outlook, Teams and computer system database. And you should have a good verbal or conversation level and written communication in Japanese. So they are looking for candidates with Japanese knowledge. So if you have this short of experience or if you have the required qualifications then you can apply through the link provided here so if you click to this link and you this link will direct you to the application page where you can apply The next opportunity is at Pfizer. So Pfizer is hiring for data management role. They are looking for candidates with one to three years of experience. And if you are interested, then you can forward a resume to chubis.joes.pfizer.com. So the next opportunity is at Bioclinica. They are looking for policies manager with eight to two years of experience in quality and compliance domain. They must, the candidate must have SOP writing, writing procedural documents in pharma and you should be from pharma and PP domain strictly. If you are interested and if you have the required qualifications and experience, you can share your CV to Rupa Sri, rupa.sri at the bioclinica.com. So the next job is at Cyro Clinic Pharma Limited. So they are looking for regulatory writing department. So for regulatory medical lighter, they are looking for candidates with minimum two years of experience in authorizing CSR, CTT modules, IB protocol, etc. Or senior principal medical regulatory writer. So in this the experience she, they are looking for is six years or above and the relevant fields are the key fields are csr ctt modules ib ib 
protocol etc as we have seen for regulatory medical right so basically the area of interest the area of experience are same but for regulatory medical writer they are looking for two years experienced candidates and for senior or principal medical regulatory writer they are looking for candidates with six years of experience if you are interested for this opportunity and you have the required expertise then you can share your cv to veda.suryavanshi at the cytocleanpharma.com so there would be hybrid work model that means you need to go to the office for one to two days per week and this you can continue from working from home so they are looking they are not looking for candidates with ba, BA or b exposure and they are also not considering freelance candidates for this position so moving on to the next opportunity so this is Aster. next job is at Asterlings global so they are hiring dss senior dss and quality reviewers for case processing and if you are interested then you can share your cv to mutharasi.v at the rate asterlings.com so basically they are looking for drug safety associate only so if someone is from poor pharmacovigilance domain and having experience in icsr case processing and quality review then this opportunity is for you and they haven't mentioned any experience details or qualification details for this post so you can contact this person or you can ping this person Manu Saidak Matthew at ping then for more information. So the next opportunity is for clinical research associate post at Hyderabad. They are looking for farm D and M farm candidates only and they are considering freshers for this role. So again, they haven't provided any mail ID to share the resume. So they have just asked, the person has only asked to DM the resume. So you can just put a comment in the LinkedIn. You can just ping this person in LinkedIn and you can contact this person for more information. But again, this opportunity is for freshers. So if you want to start up your career in the field of CRA as a CRA associate, clinical research associate, then you can contact Telza and you can get more details about this job opportunity, whether it's work from home or work from office and interview details, etc. The location would be Hyderabad. So the next opportunity is for the role of CRC clinical research Co coordinator so they are hiring for experienced candidates they are looking for a candidate who is interested in a job offer as a clinical research coordinator or clinical research coordinator so skill set required are GCP trained and should have thorough knowledge of clinical trials the location is at Pune if you have the required experience or if you want to work from Pune and if you know about clinical tests then you can mail your or drop your CV to this HR mail ID hr.orionresearch at the gmail.com and they will contact you. So the next opportunity is that episodes for trainee medical coders so they are looking for trainee medical coders at Pune and Mumbai location and this job is for freshers and they are looking for B farm and M farm graduates and BSC and SC candidates are also welcome for this job. So if you are passed out in the year 2020 or 2021 and you are freshers if you are fresher, then you can apply for this job. The prerequisites 
are excellent communication skills, basic knowledge of human anatomy and physiology. The interview type is online or telephonic and if you are interested then you can drop your CV to India Hiring at the rate episodes.com or India Hiring at the rate episodesindia.com and you can also ping this person Ganeshwar Farake the employee ID of the person has also been provided so for any sort of details any sort of query related to this job you can ping this person so again I am saying that this opportunity is for pressure so if you want to build up your careers in the field of medical coding and if you love anatomy physiology then you can apply for this job the next opportunity is at Bioclinic again so they are hiring business development manager for the EMEA region who are working in clinical or pharma space so if you can share your resume to kavita.r at the bioclinica.com or contact kavita for further details related to this job so yeah that's all guys hope you have enjoyed this video and as i say if you find this video informative on or helpful for you or if you find that someone needs a job or someone is seeking for or just looking for a job change switch over then you can just forward this video or share this video to the needful person and please do like share and subscribe our channel for getting more updates related to job related to pharmacovigilance job and if you want some different short of videos related to pharmacovigilance topics then also you can put your comment your area of interest will try to make videos on those topics so that's all guys take care bye bye have a nice day